The 2018 Best Ranger Competition winners are Team 23 from Airborne Ranger Training Brigade. Sergeants First Class Anthony Allen and Joshua Rolfus tested their physical endurance, mental agility, and technical and tactical skills during three days of events that included no scheduled sleep. It means a lot to us as a team, as friends, as uh, Ranger Brothers, the Ranger community, and the ARTB especially our peers that we work with on a day-to-day -day basis, their support, I know that they're, they're very happy for us and it feels good. With day one highlighted by an air assault on York Field, the entire starting field of 51 teams were tested early in a 60-hour stretch designed to push their limits. By dawn of day two, the field was cut to 24 teams, and those teams attacked the day early at the Spartan Run, followed by the day stakes at Todd Field. This series of events is highlighted by the Tri Towers. Go down low, you got it. Down low. After a surprise and grueling trip to Dahlonega for nighttime land navigation and another round of cuts, the surviving 16 teams began day three at the Darby Queen Obstacle Course. From there, the competition moved to Victory Pond for the combat water skills. But it was a competition in name only, because Team 23 had already mathematically guaranteed their first place finish before the day even started. After a disappointing fourth place finish in 2017, Sergeant Rolfus says winning the title became their focus for the entire year. We didn't want to leave, leave it to the last day and have to sprint on the final buddy run or whatever the last event was going to be. We wanted to go hard from the start of the competition so that we can we don't have to be so intense at the end. With the formality of the final buddy run behind them, Rolfus and Allen etched their names in history as the winners of the 35th annual David E. Grange Jr. Best Ranger competition. David Wright, Fort Benning, Georgia.